everyone, welcome back to my channel and to another grocery haul. First of all, I hope you are all okay, safe and well. If you are in the UK right now, today is the first day of the heat wave and we are not doing too bad here. We're at 31 degrees at the moment and it's half past two in the afternoon. But I know that elsewhere in the country, there will be much higher temperatures than that. And tomorrow is forecasted to be um, much hotter. So yeah, I hope you are all doing okay and keeping as cool as possible. Today, I very randomly ended up going to Marks and Spencers. I bumped into my sister-in-law whilst I was in Home Bargains and we were like, let's go and have a coffee. So we went to Marks and Spencers, which was next door, um, for a coffee and then I just ended up getting some groceries from there. I have been struggling recently actually to find some good quality uh, fruit and vegetables in Sainsbury's. I'm going to be honest, the Sainsbury's fruit and veg recently has been absolutely awful. Um, the fruit has been okay but the vegetables have been horrendous. Um, I haven't been able to buy them from there. I have been buying little top-ups from our local co-op of vegetables. So I picked up all of that kind of stuff and a couple of extra of my favourite Marks and Spencer's bits um, from there. And then I went to Sainsbury's for everything else. So this haul is a Marks and Spencer's and a Sainsbury's haul. If you are new here, then welcome. My name is Leanne. I am a mum of two boys. We are a family of four. My boys are age five and seven. I'm also on the Slimming World plan. So I do reference Slimming World during this video. I will provide SINs or information on healthy extras as it is at the moment. I have scanned everything, but please bear in mind that I can get things wrong. And I do recommend that you check these things for yourself just in case I have got it wrong or someone will change that information. But as of today, which is Monday the 17th, I think, I really don't actually know what the date is. I'm sure it's the 17th of July. If it's not, it's the Monday around that time. Um, so yeah, let's get into the haul. So this is my Marks and Spencer's haul. I've got two bags of this sweet and crunchy salad. It looks really good. It's carrot, cabbage and lettuce. Um, so I've just got those in for like dinners and lunches. Um, a pack of Pink Lady apples. These were one pound for three, which I thought was quite good. Um, some of the um, salad tomatoes and some cherry tomatoes. Um, some Percy Pig Sweets, these are for my children. Um, I've got my seven-year-old, these fizzy ones that he likes, and then my five-year-old has got these little pigs, just normal jellies. Um, I've got some just add chicken slices. I've got the Mexican style ones. These are really, really good, and they are one and a half sins for the whole pack. Um, I've got a pineapple and then some more of the just add chicken slices. I've got the hickory um, barbecue hickory smoked ones and these are one sin for the pack. Got some of these um, amaretti biscuits. These are one and a half sins per biscuit and I have opened them just to see the size of them. I thought these would be really good as like um, crumbled up on top of um, yogurt and fruit. So they'll just need a bit of some of them, but um, most of them are still in one piece. So yeah, I thought I could just crumble them up um, on desserts for one and a half sins. I thought that would make a really nice crunchy texture. Um, I picked up two packets of salad peppers, some eggs. These are on a yellow sticker, but the date is not until the 25th and I always use my eggs beyond that. Um, so yeah, they're £1.55 on a yellow sticker. Some raspberries, I must say, their raspberries looked so good. Um, so um, I got a packet of those. Some carrots, I've been really struggling to find carrots recently. Um, the supermarkets I've been to, they have just been really quite bad. And these ones don't look that great, to be honest. There are some brown ones in there, but um, yeah, I need really need some carrots. So I'm going to take these out of the bag, dry them up, and hopefully they'll keep in my salad drawer. Um, some baking potatoes. I wasn't planning on making these this week, but the quality of these potatoes looks so good. Um, I just thought oh, I'm going to have to make baking potatoes this baked potatoes this week. Um, I've got some oh, got some chunky steak. Uh, this is sin free on the Sim World plan, and it's really nice, and it just makes a really quick meal so I wanted to keep one of those in for the holidays some seedless mixed grapes again something else that I've been finding difficult to find a good quality um, grapes recently but these look really good 
Um, I thought I'd try their baked beans. They're 30 pence per tin. I have never tried M&S baked beans before, so I thought we'd give those a go. I've got two tins, and then we can pop these on our jacket potatoes with some cheese. These are sim free on a sim well plan. Stocked up on the chili noodles. We love these. Well, I do, and my five-year-old does too. They're not particularly spicy. They're just they've just got a nice flavour, really. They're one pound for a pack, and they are sin free on the sim well plan. And some sparkling water just to keep in the fridge. Nice treat with a little bit of squash in. And that is my Marks and Spencers haul. So this is my Sainsbury's haul. Um, I've got some rice pops for the kids' cereal cupboard. Um, I got some of these Quaker Ultimate Hearty Enrich Porridge Oats. They just really appealed to me. Um, I don't think the kids will like these um, because they look like they're really big oats. Um, but you can still have 40 grams of these healthy extra B choice on the Slimming World. So I thought I would pick those up for me. They were £2, so they were a little bit on the premium side, but they just really appealed to me. Um, I've got some smooth peanut butter for my children. Some balsamic vinegar. This is my favourite. This was £3. It lasts me quite a long time, but as you know, if you watch my videos regularly, I use that an awful lot. Some imperfectly tasty blueberries, they look fine to me. Um, some oak smoked ham, some pot noodles. I got three of the chicken and mushroom for my husband. The um, king ones are the same price as the small ones, they are a pound. So obviously I've got the king ones. Um, some munch bunch double up very much phrase for the kids. Um, these are so tasty. I tried a little bit of my son's. Um, these are on offer. They're one pound twenty-five for four. Um, I've got a Kvav Lindals white chocolate. These are my favourite. They're down to seventy-five pence at the moment, so I got three of those for me. Some Tassimo coffee pods. I have run out completely, and so I bought two packets. These are a real expense, um, but I'm not buying alcohol. I haven't bought alcohol for ages, so. Um, that's how I'm justifying it. <laughs> but I think I'm gonna have to do like an online saver order. Um, I would definitely be drinking more of these during the holidays. You can see my reflection in the bottle. <laughs> um, this was down to 85 pence. There was an absolute ton of them, um, all different flavors, all reduced down to 85 pence a bottle. I'm not sure why. I can't see an expiry date on this anywhere. Um, so I'm not sure if they're just not very nice or whether they're about to run out on date, but I mean, it wouldn't matter if they are, but yeah. So I picked up some apple and strawberry squash. Um, two packs of barbecue beef hula hoops. They're for the kids through the holidays. They'll probably only last barely two weeks. So yeah, I got two bags of those. Some party rings. These are the six mini bags. I know I can get these cheaper at like Home Bargains and B&M, but I couldn't be bothered to go over to B&M. And I've already been to Home Bargains today and forgot. So yeah, these were a pound and you get six mini bags. If you want to have these in your on swimming world or any other plan, the calories per bag are 83 calories and they are four tins a bag. So if you're out with the kids in the holidays, these are a good choice for a on the go snack for just four tins. Um, I got some of these animal biscuits. My five year old, I think he saw some in his friend's packed lunchbox and he keeps asking for some animal biscuits and I keep forgetting to buy them. So I found these ones. I'm not sure if these are the ones he means because these are the ones with Freddo, but you get seven little snack packs. So I thought they'd be really handy for the holidays. In terms of calories per bag, they are 97 calories or they are five sins per bag. Now I would probably um, spend five sins on these because Obviously, being little biscuits, you can make them last, and I love Freddo. Um, so, yeah, I probably would spend five sins on a bag of those. So, they're the snack biscuits for the holidays. Then I've got some medium cheddar. We're going to have baked potatoes for dinner tonight, so I'll use 30 grams of this on mine, and that will be a healthy extra A choice. Um, I've got some of this recycled kitchen roll, because we're nearly out of that. Some white rolls for my children. They've got into rolls all of a sudden. So I got some of those, some red onions. I use these all the time in everything. Some chopped chip brioche rolls for the kids. I picked up these water bottles for the kids. These were down to like £2.40, which was really cheap actually because um, the other colours of these bottles that weren't in the sale were like £8. Um, but yeah, my boys need um, constantly need new water bottles because they go a bit horrible on the top, don't they? So I picked two of those up for my children. 
some multivitamins for my five-year-old. He likes those ones. Um, these are the other two fogs. Um, I got some Pepsi Cherry Max. No, <laughs> always get this wrong. Pepsi Max Cherry flavour. That was down to £3.25 for eight cans, which is actually really good because if you take them out and about with you during the holidays, it's much cheaper than buying drinks out on the go. Um, so I always tend to carry a couple of these around um, in our cool bag. And some King's Milk 50-50 bread. You can't have this as a healthy extra B. Just want to mention that because I do get asked that quite frequently. But I don't eat bread. That's why I get this one. Um, because the kids get a bit of a balance then. And I don't overload them with fibre. Um, so yeah, that's the 50-50 bread. And then some semi-skimmed milk. And that is everything that I've bought from Sainsbury's. So that is everything that I've bought for our family so far. I've definitely spent more money than normal. I am at the £93 mark so far. And I say so far because I don't have all of our meals for the whole week. So... I haven't bought much in terms of like actual meals in this shop because I do have quite a bit in. So I've got enough ingredients to make a chorizo pasta, um, some tuna pasta. I've got some mixed beans and chopped tomatoes and things in the cupboard. So I'm going to do a mixed bean veggie chilli in the slow cooker. That will do two days. And I've also got jacket potatoes for tonight. So we've got about five meals. I probably could even pull another one out of the freezer somehow. Um, but yeah, so I will need to do a little top up. I'm going to do that after Slimming World Group on Thursday evening. Um, just for like some weekend bits. But that does add up. I expect that to be in the 20 to £30 pound range. But yeah, it is the school holidays. So we're all at home and there is a lot more um, food needed to get us through the school holidays anyway like I said I hope you are all okay and well thank you so so much as always for watching and hopefully I'll see you in the next one bye guys